the effects are just now beginning to be noticed by people in their everyday lives. So the things that are going to be worsened are things like heat waves in the summer. The expectations are there'll be weeks and weeks of temperatures over 90s in northern parts of the United States. Hurricanes are getting stronger and hurricanes are devastating to the cities that we've built along coastlines. Much or most of the U.S. population and the world population lives near a coast. Many of the biggest cities in the world are right on sea level. Weather patterns that used to be distinct to further south is now migrating upwards. And so you see people's gardens, for example, are acting differently. Or you see far more sort of illnesses of trees or pests that ought to have died uh, uh, during a particularly cold winter surviving on for longer. If you, we live in uh, places like the United States or Europe that have temperate climates, we tend to worry about tropical organisms being able to colonize and come to occupy and become established in uh, places that historically have been too cold for them. So there's some concern, for instance, that mosquitoes that carry various mosquito-borne pathogens and infectious diseases might move out of the tropics and into places like the US and Europe and expose people in those places to those tropical diseases. There's a lot of work on this topic and it looks like in some cases these concerns are probably overblown, but in other cases they're probably very valid.